Why I became an entrepreneur, I kept getting fired. I couldn't do what the folks wanted me to do, which was stay in this one little area right here and just keep cranking it out. Just do this all day. I couldn't do it. I saw opportunities here. I saw opportunities there. I saw opportunities to do things that someone like me had never done in this business. October 19th, 1987. That was the day the stock market crashed 508 points. That was my first day in business. Timing is not my forte. What it takes to be a successful entrepreneur, I believe, is to be passionate about whatever it is that you are doing. The most satisfying part about being an entrepreneur is saying we are going in this direction. We see this opportunity. We're going this way and then to make it happen. I can't think of anything else in the world I'd rather be doing than doing what I'm doing right here, right now, and working for me. We create the majority of new jobs in this country. Entrepreneurs wake up in the morning and say, I want to make this happen. But to make this happen, I have to create jobs. As the nation continues to recover from this very challenging time, entrepreneurs will play a bigger and bigger role in this nation's recovery. No matter whatever industry or business you're in, entrepreneurs must begin to come together because ultimately we all have the same interests, building businesses. And traditionally, we all know entrepreneurs are used to going along, doing it on their own, not waiting for or are needing someone else to come and join. But in order for us to be successful, I believe this is a good time for a lot of us to begin to join forces, to make our voices heard and policies that are going to be affecting us first and most. This is the time right now for us to come together. There is so much more that unites us as entrepreneurs and as people than there is that separates us. Guess what, you wake up one morning, you've been downsized, outsourced, laid off, and fired. Now who are you? This is a very exciting time for a lot of us to just look at ourselves and say, what is it that's really important to me? What do I really want to be doing? Those are very big questions. And maybe it's time for a lot of us to contribute to a new definition of the American dream. Build a stronger America. Join the entrepreneurs' movement.